over the last decade, a, a new generation of uh, incubators were developed that provides us with the ability to monitor our embryos without removing them from the incubator, which means that the embryos, thanks to these incubators, will remain in a secluded culture environment. We don't need to remove them in order to assess their progress and development. And on the other hand, thanks to these incubators, they, uh, we ha uh, have the ability to have an, an amazing and a huge a number of information and morphokinetic uh, data of the embryo as the embryos are monitored uh, through um, an, uh, every few minutes, 10 to 20 minutes, which means that by the end of the culture, we will have a whole small video with lots and lots of shots of the embryo and we can assess the embryo development in a very big high detail. A recent progress is that this morphokinetic uh, uh, monitoring of the embryo was linked to uh, with the uh, artificial intelligence technology. So uh, we now have available automated ways of embryo selection which help us improve the selection of the embryos based on their morphokinetic development and hence improve the ability the chances for a pregnancy.